I was already 45 years old when I made my first million. We came from a very tough background. <coughs> we knew the value of money. <coughs> but look at these young men in less than 40s. They've started counting money in millions. And they are challenging our powers. Is this not madness? Let me tell you something. You have one major problem in your life. And that is, you talk too much, cho -cho 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 -cho, like wither boys. We are here to plan on how to attack those young men so as to redeem our uh, social relevance. You are talking about what happened yesterday. Oh, oh, how could you accuse me of talking too much? In a cool area time. We have a serious problem. And that's what you don't know. This is no time for trash. Listen, my brother. I know that we have a serious problem on our hands. Let me help you out that way. You know what happened last week? I donated 50% of the total amount needed to dualize that road leading to the civic center. Okay. Imagine Malone. Hey, small boy. David Okolo. Yeah. Told them to return my money to me. What? That he would single-handedly construct the road. If you see what I did. Emily Hoffman. You see what I mean? More and more of those young men are springing up in this street of the city. And if nothing is done fast to tempt them, one day we wake up, our prestige and everything is gone. You know, there is something that both of you are forgetting. You don't set a trap for an animal in front of that animal. Mm -mm. The animal does not have to be there when you make your trap. Just set the trap, leave it in its lair. It will come back and it will be caught. Master, uh, actually, I don't understand you. We are talking over a serious issue. We are talking about animal, lair, uh, hunters, trap. I don't understand you. All right. You've just talked about what David Okolo did to you. That idiot. Yes. Right. If I tell you my experience with him, Yours will pale into insignificance. Ivo Mele. Yes, Yenti. You know that the secretary to the government is my friend. My friend. Through him, I was able to acquire 10 parcels of land, which I paid for. Later, a letter was written to me from his office claiming that the government wanted to reacquire those parcels of land. No problems. I let them have the land and they return my money. You're lucky now. Okay, you're lucky. Hey. On investigation, I found that David Okulu 
put four million naira on each parcel of land. In other words, he topped my own offer with 40 million. Hey! And they gave all those lands to him. Are you serious? Yes. Hey! Look at me. There's a big move. Hey, a small boy like that insults me. Look, if I had known that this was why he called us here. Why? No, no, that's a while. I have completed arrangements on how to deal with that young man. Oh, yes. I will go to his house and teach him a lesson. He will know that on the day his mother was married, I was there. No, no. Two heads are better than one. I mean, two good heads. In this case, Machi, I'm going with you. Hey, Lily. Hey, I think we can drink now. When the mother came. I don't think it's a good idea to go to his house. Huh? You don't like the idea at all? I don't think so. If you going, hold on a moment. Hold on a moment, I got no idea of it. We are going there. If you insist, that's up to you. I think we can drink now. Yes, so that's for just a minute. Yes, good afternoon, sir. Uh -huh. Yes, how are you? Fine. I want to see David Okolo. Yes, I mean, I know who you are, please. Huh? Eh? Yes. <laughs> hey, hey. Turn it, turn it, turn it. Hey, hey. All right, this is Chief Eze Binugu Wam of Waza. Mo wan on wem. Elile de Kego. Say na chief, I have a lot of wear. You know go? Elile de Kego. My friend, go ahead, go open the gate. Go. Of Waza. What? Okay. Suggest that you have the capacity to solve our 
problems. I mean, don't be able. You're shouting. We're not shouting. We are not shouting. I do not like shouting. I am allergic to shouting. We are not shouting. <laughs> well, and it appears as if uh, you do not have any problems. So I don't see any way I can help you. So if you don't mind, can you leave on your own? Or you want me to make you leave? Do you? You are asking us to leave your house. Hey! Is it been you have been insulted by a kid? You are asking us to leave your house. You heard me loud and clear. Alright? Do you want to leave on your own? Or you want me to make you leave? Oh well, it appears you want me to make you leave. Insulting, is it? Don't <laughs> Let's not tell him anything, let's go.
Somani Somata Somani Somato Somani Somata I am Rujiana, the spiritual head of the assembly of the archivals. Archival Wanedo, you sent urgent signal to all the men of Archival. Tell them what is disturbing you. Ojiana, I greet you. I am disturbed, and most members of this order are also disturbed. Archival Wanedo. I am not disturbed. As Ojana has said, tell us what is disturbing you. There are some young men who have constituted themselves into some shape for me and my friends. Who are the young men and who are your friends? The one we hate most is David Okolo. He is being referred to as Ababodikis, but he calls himself Omeliwe. He has made life very uncomfortable for me and my two friends, one and Omela. You want him dead? No, Jana, no, 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 no. We can kill him, three of us. Is it Binugu? Obelago and myself, But we have our reasons. We don't want him dead yet. The trouble is this, Ujana. This boy has too much money. Too much Ujigo. Is that why you send such an urgent signal? Don't you have too much money yourself? Okada Oranye, you are beginning to take this matter very personal, and I don't like it. We are talking about a, a group of young men who saw the marriage ceremonies of their mothers challenging us, and that is what we want to stop. So, you want some money? Or do you want more power? Oh, right. You are beginning to insult me. Yes, of course. You are not in charge of this assembly. Yes, of course. So please keep quiet. Yes, of course. What do you want? Uh, <clears throat> Ujana, these boys belong to an unknown order. They are so powerful, so influential, they have so much money that they now dare to challenge us. The first one is this, Ujana. We want to know the name of that mysterious order. Secondly, we want to know how to destroy that order. I mean, how to annihilate that order. I am sorry if my submission is being misunderstood. But I want to find out specifically what these young men have done as to warrant their destruction. Hey! Hey! Akaiba Oranye, why are you behaving this way this night? The total number of men we had in this order as of 30 years ago was 21. Have you bothered to ask yourself why others were destroyed? They were destroyed as a result of their greed and the desire to dominate others. And three of you are following the same evil path. What you can? Ah. Akaival Oranye, I am senior to you in this order. Yes, of course. Therefore, you are not in a position to advise me. Yes, of course. The head of this assembly 
is all Gianna. Yes, of course. A Cairo wanted to. I have heard what you and your friend have said. Meet me like normal men on top of Igbo Mountain tomorrow night. The time is archival time. And I will tell you what to do. So Mali, so Mali, so Mali. So mommy, so Manta. The prayer of every man is to have children that will supersede him. Why do you seek to destroy a child? Uh, my Lord Spiritual, that prayer is only valid if the child obeys Yes, and what, what, and yeah. what makes you think the child is disobedient? If it's a, look, he yeah. chased us out of his house with bodyguards. That in itself is very disrespectful. Uh, uh, we want to get to the root of his powers so we can avoid uh, the crimes. Uh, Can't you see? It's an insult to us. There is a lady that lives beyond the black leg. For seven days and seven nights, you shall travel deep into the forest of our Balide. <laughs> you will see nightmares in broad daylight. And I cannot explain what you will see in the night. But you must be focused and stay fast. I can imagine what I can see in the night too. If you can hang on till the end, we shall see the lady beyond the black leg. Oh, Jana. Is she the source of his powers? She is not. <laughs> but she is. Look, what do you mean by that? Is, uh, uh, oh, Jana. I mean, what do you mean by that? She is not. Because she is not the root of his powers. But she is. Because you cannot find the root without her. Yeah. Therefore, prepare yourselves and prepare your minds equally so that we shall not be taken on our words. Mm. So, my I understand the journey at all. I understand. What has he just told us? Nothing. She is not the root of his power. And the power, the power of the world. What, 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 what kind of rubbish is that? I told you before, you see that, those is the uh, uh, hmm. When he talks, he sees him moving through the He's talking nonsense. But not say what is it. Hey. Okay, he's gone. Matakochaka. 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 It has been written from the days of old that it shall come to pass one day when the youth shall rise and take over the control, the management, the government of their states. I want to tell all the members of the robust order of Mata Pochaka that the time is now. Why is one? Bring the youths from the state of Onono and ready to take over control of the affairs of our state. But if we must do that, wise one, we need powers, extraordinary power, to be able to challenge and question the ancient and already unacceptable powers. I mean, status quo existing in our state. How do we do that? Our body keys, you have the power. But I want you and your friends from Unum to get ready for the mother of all war. You speak in parables, my lord. What do you mean? There are men that control your state. I know them as an archiver. As I'm talking to you now. 
They are getting ready to embark on a journey to Ochoa, along the lonely and evil forest of Balido. Wise one, who are these men? Who are they? And how does their program affect us? How? Who are these ones, wise one? We need to know what you're up against. How do you I'm talking to you again? When you are the new world, Belago, To the two men you sent out from your heart, you will have the men that consider you as jealous. Mwata kwacha haka. Usolo wa galanya yeo kyo. Mwata kwacha haka. Usolo wa galanya yeo kyo kyo. Mwata kwacha haka. Usolo wa galanya yeo kyo kyo. Go first. You are stupid. Me? You. Let me tell you something about yourself that you don't know. Wando. You are very stupid. Yes. You are stupid. You are very stupid. Elili, since both of you are stupid, let us go. Let's go. Yes. All right. Okay. Good. You go first. Abelago. Because you are not stupid, go first now. Me? Yes. yes. You yes. go, you are not stupid. Go! Don't be bending. I'm taking small. Wando, since you said you won't be the first, and you will not be the last, Follow him. Go, my friend, go like a woman. Go. I don't want to see you, my Dime, I'm not one. The question is this. Must we embark on this tough journey? Instead of sitting at home and killing idiots and solve our problems once and for all. And I'm to be okay. I no. You heard all the time we wanted to ask this question at home before we embarked on this journey. Now that we have commenced, you want to stop us in the bush here to find out why we embarked on it in the first place. I think it's too late. Let's just continue. Ah. Wait, let's continue. Okay, okay I'm ready. But I can show off one thing. Mm. Three of us will run like fools in the evil forest of Obalidem. And I swear to you, I won't be the first to run. Who do you think will be the first to run? <laughs> one of you. <laughs> and once there's the first, I sure I'll be the second. Mm. I won't be the first to run. I won't be the last. Okay. Why don't we just continue until we encounter what will make us run? <laughs> One question. What is the question you are asking? 
Is this punishment? How can we be moving since 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. without rest? Huh? Well, yeah. when we get to the building around to make a rest there. Uh, that's for you. For the past 29 years, Maji, I've never done without my siesta. And I won't learn how to do without my siesta because of you and... No! One day you're always causing tension. We're here for a very serious problem. How could you be talking at rest? I have a right to talk about it. I told you, sir, this is Chief Wanedo, and this is Obelago. Uh, please, sir, who are you and what do you want? We are peaceful. I am Melede, huh? the owner of the famous Melede Mountain. I came to warn you, do not sleep on my mountain. And when you find I spare food on that mountain, do not pick or drop anything on it. Come, 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 I'm not, I'm not enjoying this book a lot at all. Why? I told you, let us kill that lizard and roast it. You eh? kill it. Is I that... like eating meat, yes. Destiny in 
be a hand. Wise one, the danger you speak of exists in the state of Mumu. And I believe David Okola and his friends No, Ozaga, I don't know you are wrong. And I'm not fooling you, Luaz. It is wrong for you to think that the war is a war of only a few members of Matakocha. We are going to fight as a united family. Wise one, what do you want us to do? There is this comment I make all the time. Women are the most inconsistent creatures on earth. No matter what you tell them, as soon as somebody else tells them anything that is different and supposedly better, they will abandon you and everything you said, and they will go after the one they just heard. Women, like all virgins, are absolutely vulnerable. How do you mean, wise one? I told you about some men I called men of archive. I told you they were getting ready to embark on a journey. But right now, they are already embarking on that journey. They are passing through the lonely and evil forest of Obalidem to go and meet the lady that lives all alone beyond the Black Lake. That lady is the perfect definition of inconsistency. We must not allow the men of Archiva to see that lady. We must move to scatter them. Wise one. But if they get to see the lady, is that going to be a problem? I wouldn't know whether she will eventually open up to them. But in my one million years as the minister in charge of this order, I have come to realize that women must never be trusted. Never. Because even when they have become spirits, they still possess the traits of women. Wise one, you still have not answered my question. What do you want us to do? I know what I'm going to do. I only called you all to tell you of the danger ahead. In my capacity as Ababa, the minister in charge, I am going to meet the men of our carnival in that forest of Obalidem to see if they will sign an agreement with me. Should I come with you also? Hey! Chief! Hey! Hey! Okay. What's, what's bothering you? Look, two different blocks from different, two different mountains have appeared before us so far. The dwarf, Shortinus, and the giant, Longinus. But he didn't even notice anything there. The two of them gave us conflicting reports and ended up talking absolute nonsense in Abaruru. Elili, why do you specialize in making very irresponsible statements? You talk very disrespectfully of lords of mountains, even refer to them as talking absolute nonsense. How could you say that? Oh, oh, oh you don't even know. You don't know. Okay, listen to this. The dwarf. Shortinus told us not to pick or drop anything on top of Mbilede Mountain. All right? Longinus, the giant, said we should sacrifice on top of the same Mbilede Mountain. How do you reconcile it? Hey, tell me, how do you reconcile it? Hey, huh? I don't want to see this way. Ah, after I say I'm drunk. I am the only one here who sees beyond the ordinary. What do you advise me to do? Better. Better. One, <clears throat> let us follow the instructions of the giant. He can even claim ownership of all the mountains around this forest. I don't care. Boto, Sotinus, that dwarf. Has no right to tell me that he owns any mountain. Even the small one. So what exactly are you suggesting that we do? Let us follow the instruction of the giant. 
The dwarf has no right to order us around, especially me. Me go what? Elili, oh no. The power of a god does not depend on the size. Are you a god? Ah, evil god. The small gods are very powerful when it comes to power too. They know what touch got. They go even balloon. Ah, Elili, Ejima Ojinaka, Abelago. Yeah. We pull up, pull up, Elili. We pull up, pull up. As Mugu Torji, he said, I know Torji, he said, Abala Torji, he said, I love Waga Torji. Oh, I'm listening to Torji. Oh, I'm listening. What do you want? I ordered him never to pick or drop anything on top of my mountain. I have secret reasons for giving that order. You stand before me to talk about fairness. What do you know about being fair? I have never encouraged anyone to define the small people mountain. Why are you encouraging men to define my mountain? You are the one who defied your mountain. How could you give such orders when you know such order cannot be kept? How do you mean? Go back to those men and rephrase your orders. No one walks through Mbelede mountain without picking something. And even if they pick nothing, they must pick dust. And that will amount to picking something. But I am the lord of my mountain. I make the final rules. Go back to those men and rephrase your orders. That is all I have to say for now. <laughs> us and dropped a contrary order. Now we are confused. Mwano. How do you call him my boss? Who told you he's my boss? There are my tanks there, my friend. He's big. Go and wait up. Don't put that your mother and tell me that you are his boss. Even my, 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 my saga can't do one. He's the lord of Ipo Mountain and the lord of Mbelede Mountain. Laws are laws. No one is bigger than other. Yeah, I wait, wait, wait. Don't insult him, so let's let's know why he is here. Look, even though he's a small spirit, he's a strong spirit. Spirit, we go. Please tell us. Sorry. After a sacrifice to the Lord of Ipo Mountain, then you must offer a bigger sacrifice to the entire spirit that dwells in Mbede Mountain. So we can now drop. And pick something on top of Mbele Mountain. Bia, my brother. Eh, I'm going to say, you know, you're a man. The sacrifice to Mbele Day must be bigger than sacrifice to Ipo. Yeah, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, Oh, no. You see, he has disappeared. You see now? You are sleeping. Eh? You see now? I said it before. What is the effect of our We should have opposite? waited for him to Wait tell us. Now he has disappeared. Therefore, eh? It's not going to kill that idiot and solve this problem once and for all. Now, what are we going to sacrifice? To who? Where? When? What? Somami Somanta. That is our archival slogan. And you don't have a right to use it. It belongs only to the archivals. So who are you? There is a lady that lives alone beyond that lake. She is the one you seek because Ojana, your Lord Spiritual, told you she has information on how you could cage a young man who is working on money 
and by extension, working on your heads. Uh, your information is right. So, what do you want us to do with you? The lady you seek is my wife. And you cannot see my wife without seeing me. Wait, 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 wait. Are you not telling us that you are the husband of the lady that lives beyond the Black Lake? I slept with her last night. Eh? And even this night, I will sleep with her again. What? You see what I mean? I mean you see what I mean now? Huh? How can I explain this? That I, the only, just one of them, any lady can go one of us that I, will be here running around the bush in an attempt to see a lady whose husband is nothing but a Okwadike. Eli Leje Gego, you must mind how you speak. I am Ababa, the minister in charge of the robust order of Mata Kochaka. I'm not Okwadike. I have remained a minister for one million years. If you have any genuine intention of ever seeing my wife, then you must enter an agreement with me. Could you allow us to speak privately, to discuss this matter privately? Hmm. I will see you when you need me. Hey, well, I don't know what you people think of, but for me, I would never go into any agreement with an awkward gay man. The man is an awkward gay He introduced himself as a baba. He will soon be my mama. You see, well, the person we are talking about is not an ordinary person. Hmm? He claims to have been a minister in that kingdom for the past one million years. Look, that is what he told us. Ah, can any of us prove it? We can never prove it. Oh, yeah, I got you. I see you're going to I agree that we cannot prove it. You have a very strong point. Well, there are things he said that we cannot contest. One. He claims to be married to the lady we are looking for. Hmm. Two, he claims to have slept with her last night and there's every possibility that he is likely to sleep with her again tonight. Oh. Three, if we enter into an agreement with him as he has suggested, there's every possibility that we might persuade him to bring his wife over here then we can discuss with her directly as she could provide the solution to our problems. In other words, if we are able to do that, they should have saved us the agony of roaming endlessly in this forest. Can't you see? You have a point there. You want to do? my guy. You have a point there. In fact, this is the first time you have said anything sensible since we started this job. One, hmm? you are very stupid. Since. Okay, so let us invoke him now and ask him to invoke his wife. We can settle this case once and for all here. Instead of women around the bush. Let's just invoke him. Come on. All right. Um, Wando. Hey. Invoke him. I know you can. Invoke him. sign it but before then you must invoke your wife here so we can finish this matter once and for all beautiful beautiful stretch out your hands and you shall have agreement Drink this and I see what is stress. You need the fact. Deliver. 
If you didn't stretch your hand, would there have been any calabash like this? Open up for them. In less than 40 hours from now, you will be with the lady you seek. She's not the solution. But she's the only mediator between you and the solution. Uh, Ojana, would you be gracious enough to accompany us? for the rest of the journey. So, mommy! Hey! You see? It's not, oh. even, it's not even helping us at all. Ah. Tell Chief about that Harry is here to see her. Mba. Nice. Oga. Call Chizoba on your phone. Tell her that you are here. She will now call me on my intercom to signal me to bring you in. I will do that. I have tried to reach out her GSM phone and I can't seem to get her. I think she switched off. Go in and tell her that Harry is here to see her. Oga, try it again. Maybe you are closer to the service. She will understand. Listen to me, old man. Okay, I'm not good though. I'm not my I work on top of money. Go and tell Chizoba that Henry, Nkela Gije Nenego is here. Did I hear you say you work on top of money? You go yara, I want you to go yara. Listen to me, I'm not my yara. I'm not my yara. I know you go. You go now, go my yara. Come, Peter, come. Come, 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 come. Tell me what you want to tell me. Okay, what is this now? Hey, hey. hey. You said I should give to see this for you. It's your own. Go and touch it. Okay, I'm on the money. I'm on the money. I'm the fragrance. This is for me. I'm on my gig. Hey! Where you go? Okay? Back somewhere. Every protocol. You are no more observing them. They get you. What's up? 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 Oh yes, I'm a wa. In a gig, you're a good chop. Sour, sour, seven, seven. Chip, chip, Why, oh, why, oh, seven, seven. No more protocol observation. Sour, sour, seven, seven. Chip, chip, Why, oh, why, oh, seven, seven. Chip, chip, chip. Who are you 
tongue by tongue. What can you do? I must change hands. I must change hands. I need to My friend, who are you? Oga, he's looking for Shizoba, and I have to allow him. He's a VIP. VIP? VIP, looking for my daughter. Oga, ask him. My friend, who are you? Well, uh, my name is Henry. Henry. And like I told you, I am looking for your daughter, Jesus. What gave you the audacity to come into my compound and say you are looking for my daughter? Can you give me one reason why you are here? Well, um, I am asking you. You have asked for just one reason. Yes. But uh, I will give it to you. First, I am looking for your daughter because she's a very beautiful girl. <laughs> Second, I am eminently qualified to woo your daughter because I know that I can provide for you. So, as a matter of fact, you have come here to woo my daughter. I have come here to woo your daughter. Wow. Thank you. This is very, very The hand that is immediately drunk is strong enough. Oh, you, Baba? Oga? Take him to her wing. Oga, this is good. Mata, Baba, Mbonu, Ma. Oje, Vije, Nego. Oko, Uje, Eno, Di, Odo. Umu, Boy, Sabi, Ako. Aga, Di, Te, Chance. Umu, Guys, Uwe, Me, Me, Go. Sawa, Sawa, Be, Be, Se, Be. Why oh my oh seven seven? Jibi jenego. Sawa sawa seven seven. Jibi jenego. Why oh my oh seven seven? Jibi jenego. Whoa, but on by on. What can you do to make me go? Oh, I must change hands. I need your young guys to lean and get you to do it. Sawa, sawa, sepem, sepem. JV, JV, why oh, why oh, sepem, sepem. JV, JV, sawa, sawa, sepem, sepem. JV, JV, why oh, why oh, sepem, sepem. JV, JV. Where nature 
could be. But I'm not too sure. It's all right. Uh, there doesn't seem to be any other house here, so it <coughs> must be the house we are looking for. There must be sun before the rain. If there is no sun, there can be no rain. Uh, <coughs> lady, we are distinguished men of the archival family. We have come quite some distance to look for the lady who lives beyond the Black Lake. Are you the woman we seek? Sleep and death have a striking resemblance. But men love the former and hate the latter. What do you want? Eh? I want. I prefer the former. I'm Wando, not Mom. Eh, hey, that reminds me. We met a man, a rickety looking man, who looked very much like him. Um, oh, he claimed to be a husband though. Uh, he says anything about the river melee. I'm going to drink out. All right, no need. But is he your husband? Elili! Ta! Elili! Elili, they can't go. Thread using time money. Hey, why not? Come on. I'll stop with that. Why not? Are you dead or alive? No, I would leave that at home. I've died more than 40 times in the past seven days. But now I'm alive. Why not? I'm alive. Please ignore Elili. Elili has a knack for making very silly and provocative utterances. Are you the lady we seek? I am the lady you seek. Agree. Come with me. Follow me into my cave. And you will see the woman in me. The woman in you? Oh, give me a Hey, I'll take a hug.
So how do we engage them? Because as I told you earlier, for seven days and seven nights we roamed the forest just to get to you. Because we were told you have a solution to our problems. What must we do, Lady of the Lake? What must we do? That's the question. If only you could be initiated into it. Yeah. You mean going to your car to into you? Yes. Well, I'm going to go through. Then you can fight the youth to a standstill. Did you say uh, we must be um, initiated into you? Yes. Uh, right. Can you permit us to put our heads together so we can deliberate on this? Okay. That's good. We are in a dilemma. What the white man calls Hobson's choice, take it or leave it. What a very silly option this is. I mean, come on. What do you think about it? Uh, to be frank with you, Manelo, I see no dilemma here at all. Let us sensibly and quickly go there now and get initiated into her. You are, eh? She has enormous powers. Power is power. It doesn't matter where it comes from. He can weak it. Why, man, muscle? Do you really believe that lady when she says that seven lords of the archival emptied themselves into her? She was in modesty. Why are you okay for fault? If this is your argument, the argument is flawed. In our city, the ordinary second school girl can reduce seven men to nothing. Let alone an old archiva. She is coming up. She's coming up. The seven lords. Even capacity to contain seven times three. Now we're times twenty-one. Nyata maha. Wait a minute. Babelago. Yes, sir. Do I take that to mean that you are in support of one yeah, exactly. contention? That we go in there and sink our manhood into that lady. Oh, just yeah. Yeah. Let us come. Let's go and do this. 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 Let's go Oh, 